to use the product pop-up, make sure you're in the Forms area and in the Promotions tab. Then click Create Promotion. Give your promotion a name and click Save and Continue. Now choose the product pop-up template by clicking Select. And here's the form editor. You can change the type of form on the top right over here. You can have it on the bottom left corner and with these additional settings you can switch it to the right position if you want and if you want this text to show on the bottom just click bottom right over here but let's go back to the form type and click design settings here you can change all the different types of colors you see in this form by clicking and changing the colors here you can make for example the close button darker change the color of the hover area and then click save when you're done now when you hover the color will change of course you can change the color of the sidebar here make it a lot darker if you want but I am going to keep it light like this and click save and the form background of course I'm going to change this to gray of course in this case I would need to find an image without a white background otherwise this is not going to work and if I want to go back I can just click undo here and the color will change back to the original one and I can go through the history and change these colors again to the original colors once you're done with all the colors you can click every specific element and do more changes for example if you do not want this little text here just click the little trash can and it will hide it and then you can use the preview button to see how the form will actually look once you're done there we go we don't see that other part of the form now let's go back here is the block sidebar which is hidden let's make it come back to life and now let's look at the other elements here we can change the image we can of course delete it too. enter a URL so that if someone clicks that image I always like to put the same URL I put uh, in the button I like to put it in the image and you can also count it as a conversion so this will show up in your statistics of course change the price have an old price because this is an, a promotional pop-up right so we usually want to have some type of promotion either in price or in something else you can add some additional text here add links if needed and change the title right over here of course once you're done just click save and next here are the different types of modes you can choose for the pop-up. You can show five seconds after someone has visited your website or for example, 50, 75 or 100 percent. This means that when someone scrolls to 50 percent of the specific page, the pop-up will show. The frequency is pretty important. If this is a promotion, maybe and it will last for 10 days, maybe once a day would be good for this type of promotion. Of course, you can have it show all the time every single time the person visits the website or page this pop-up will show up then we have the schedule you can close the promotion at a specific time and start it at a specific time of course visibility show it always hide on specific pages or show it only on specific pages you can also hide it on desktops mobile devices and tablets once you're done just click save and continue this is the code you will be using on your website. If you have already put this code on one of your websites before using your MailerLite account, then you will not need to repeat this step. Then we have the sign up form plugin for WordPress if you're using that and our MailerLite app for Shopify if you are using Shopify. After you're done, just click next. You can activate the pop up right over here edit it again the design here's a little preview edit the behaviors again here is this code I just talked about and this is a show promotion on click event so if you're writing an article if you want someone to click a specific word in that article that is linked to this pop-up then this is what you will use just follow the instructions and this should work fine for you and that's it one more thing the stats if you set up the conversions this is where it will show the impressions and the conversion rate of course that's all for this pop-up thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in the next tutorial hey thanks for watching the video please click subscribe use the little bell icon you can also catch us on facebook instagram twitter and of course use the little subscribe link in the description to sign up to our newsletter thanks again and see you in the next video